Hi, I'm Michael Triantis. Hi, I'm Shreya Daga. Hi, I'm Joshua Blair. And we are the founders of Ripple. Ripple, an organization founded by four current UVA students, aims to bring high-profile speakers to free-to-access events. I was able to speak with three of the four co-founders of Ripple and learn about this new business. We run events where we bring really cool, distinguished speakers for an hour, and we start off a conversation, kind of like a chat, and gather questions prior from audience members. All our talks are completely focused on the audience members and their questions. For these students, it was a class that they took together back during the spring semester that kickstarted this venture. Josh and Hisham and I were all in the same entrepreneurship class and our professor, Chip, he brought in a John Lee Hancock and we thought, wow, he was able to get a Hollywood director on and it just seems that people have more free time now and we could probably kind of use this, leverage this and create a platform of our own. How did you guys come up with the name Ripple? Or what is that? Like, what is the significance of that? So basically, we started off being Core and Talk. Then we decided to rebrand because some people were misinterpreting the name. And then we chose the name Ripple because what we're trying to do in society is create a change which starts from us and then like ripples outward, like affects everyone. Prior to each event, the group spends numerous hours reaching out to potential guests, trying to find incredibly qualified speakers. Initially, a lot of it was just mass emailing speakers. Now we've kind of branched out into four topics. We focus on health, tech, entertainment, and social justice. As a small startup, the co-founders have had to be creative in order to promote their new idea. The main thing we do is like whatever speaker we have, we reach out to different university departments whose students we think could benefit from the talk. We also post regularly on our Instagram for our followers. So far, the group has had four events hosting Josh Luber, the CEO of StockX, Brian Ferguson, the CEO of Arena Labs, award-winning director John Lee Hancock, and YouTube travel vlogger Mike Corey. For these entrepreneurs, their personal lives have played a huge role in creating this organization. Listening to people who have so much life experience without like giving up on any other thing was something I really liked. Me personally, like I like to volunteer a lot. So like giving back has always been very important to me. Just trying to provide inspiration during a difficult time, I think is really important. And that's kind of our, our mission statement. What drives me to do this a lot of time is that I like the fact that it's a free opportunity for people as well. I like the fact that people can just join on and get inspiration from like a really cool and distinguished speaker during a hard time. And for these students, their favorite part of Ripple events actually occur after the event is over. I really like after events, we'll usually get like a good amount of emails saying like, thank you, or like, I really gained a lot from this, or like my favorite is like, can you send me a link so I can share it with more people? Talking to audience members is like, has been really cool too, because we've seen like people from all over the world join our events. After the event is always great, because I get a couple of text messages and everyone's like, oh, that was so great, really learned a lot. So that kind of really makes my day and it kind of makes everything worthwhile. So I did my first talk last week and whoever was watching, like some of my friends were there, they just like texted me, they were like, wow, I'm so proud of you that you actually did it in front of so many people. And while Ripple initially began as a way to provide aid during the COVID-19 pandemic, the group now has plans to continue talks well into the fall. One of the main reasons we rebranded was because that we wanted it to last past quarantine and we do think that we're adding value and like our service would be in demand past the quarantine so yeah we're definitely looking forward to continue this after this is all over where can people find you so if anyone watches this video and is really interested in look what you guys do where can they find you guys our website is rppl.online our IG is rppl.it our linkedin is ripple rppl same with our facebook and our YouTube channel is RPPO as well if you want to watch the videos.